Hi everyone, my name is Ben Irons and I'm a sound healer, musician, meditation guide, and author based in Boulder, Colorado. This is my studio, Zen with Ben, and I'm here today to speak more about the new Dragonfly Percussion Singing Bowl Implements, and specifically in this video, the new Polycarbonate Wands for metal or Himalayan singing bowls. Now, this wand is my go-to for recording and live sessions, especially in large spaces, like if you're facilitating a sound bath meditation in a yoga studio, for example. They express a full tapestry of sound. They have a weighted core that maintains the fundamental tone of your bowl, and the polycarbonate composite brings volume and a full spectrum of sound out of each and every one of your metal singing bowls. The tactile sensations of this wand feel very similar to leather or to wood, but without that obnoxious white noise. They're hefty, but they are comfortably balanced in the hand and feature this foam grip that help prevent fatigue in a longer playing session. So let's give this a listen and just see how we compare. So I've got my traditional wand or puja here. Um, this is a two-sided wand. Uh, it has leather on one side and wood on the other. This is a five, just over a five inch uh, vintage Himalayan bowl from Nepal. I'm gonna guess early 60s. It's got quite a bit of weight behind it. And so what I've found is when I've tried to sing this bowl in the past, I really struggle to get the wand to help express what this bowl is capable of. See, it takes a lot of energy to make this bowl go. And I'm really fighting against the weight of it. I can prime it. But even then, I don't love the quality of sound. We can switch to the wood side, but it's gonna bring out more higher partials. The softer leather side will always bring out more fundamental vibration and tone, while when you switch to a harder surface, it'll start to bring out more of those higher partials. And while the sound is certainly more present, I don't love the quality of sound. Now we could add a little bit more mass and go to a traditional wood puja. It's better, but I still, for my ear, feel that the sound is quite distorted. Now, if you've been working with singing bowls for uh, quite a while, you might have come across this handy tool before. Uh, this is an excellent Exolite 99 screwdriver handle. I love the story behind these. It came out of uh, recording studios in LA in the early 1980s. Um, this has a very clean sound, but they're extremely treacherous to play with, and I'll show you why. So I love the fundamental tone. I think, again, it's a very clean sound, very little contact noise, more higher partials start to come through. But because we're playing on this playing surface, you're really walking a razor's edge as you work with this, uh, with this particular implement. And now we have the Dragonfly Polycarbonate Wand. Very easy to play with, very comfortable in the hand, easy to maneuver and manipulate as you're facilitating. The weighted core again has that maintained fundamental tone, much more presence of sound, and a full spectrum of overtones are coming through from this bowl as well. Night and day from where we started. This is the small polycarbonate wand. There's also the larger model as well, a little bit more weight behind it. So I've got my modern um, Jabati um, bowl from Nepal here, uh, just over 10 inches. Again, very easy to play, full spectrum of sound. Great when you're recording or in a live studio when you need to really fill out the space with tone. So the new polycarbonate wands from Dragonfly Percussion, available now.